بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم Let us go for the first example of condensed income statement and these are the information. From the following information, prepare condensed income statement for ABC Limited on 31st December 2019 and the tax applicable to the company is equal to 20%. And following are the rest of the information. For example, we have information regarding purchase, purchase return as well as purchase allowance. We have sales, total sales, then we have cash sales and credit sales. Then we have sales return, we have sales discount, opening inventory, closing inventory. Indirect expenses, it means non-operating expenses. Indirect income, it means non-operating income. Direct expenses, selling and distribution expenses, and as well as administrative expenses. So in order to solve this one, the first thing that we need is the format. So we have to draw the format. As we know, of course, format is a time consuming. So I want to copy the format from the previous slide. So this is basically the format of condensed income statement. What we need here to solve, basically, we have to put the value into the format and get the answer. That's it. So the first thing in the format we need is basically total sales. Total sales equal to cash sales plus credit sales. How much is cash sales and how much is credit? You can just simply mention in the format, right? Or mention, for example, how much is cash sales? Cash sales equal to, for example, 350,000, right? So remove cash sales. Cash sales equal to 350,000 plus credit sales. How much is credit sales? Credit sales equal to 50,000, right? Equal to how much? 50,000. مگر یک اگر متوجه باشین به خاطر که باز نیا کنفیژن ایجاد نشه با میتونید یک یک روی دیگه می جای اضافه کنی یک شان نشته کنی کاش سیاست یا کریدیت سیل میسه که نگاره چی کردم نشته کردم که خوبتر فهمیده شوه که کسی که می خونه بفهمه که کدومش کاش است کدومش کریدیت است رایت سو این اولر تو میک ات اندرستاندیبل سو میک ات سو میک وان رو فور کاش سیلز اند آلسو میک وان رو فور کریدیت سیلز این اولر تو میک ات میک ایبل میک ات ایبل فور دی ریدرز تو اندرستاند دت which one is cash sales and which one is credit sales. So for the time being, it is okay. So we know now, for example, this is cash and this is credit. Total of this one become equal to how much? Four lakh. Four lakh is the total of total sales. Then from this one, we have to minus sales return, allowance, and discount. Do we have these things or not? If you check, you have yes. We have sales return as well as we have sales discount. Sometimes you may have allowance as well. Then mention this amounts as well. So first of all, let us find out the total of these two. How much is sales return? Even for sales return also, sales return and sales discount also, you can do the same thing. So make it a specific which one is uh, sales return and which one is sales discount. How much is sales return? Sales return is equal to 20,000 plus. How much is sales discount? Sales discount is amount of 3,000, right? So please make it understandable which one is cash sales and which one is credit sales. For this purpose, inside the bracket, you can mention, for example, discount, or inside the bracket, you mention, you can, you can mention that this one is a return, right? So whatever is the amount for this time, this is amount of 20, 23,000, right? So 20,000 and 3 plus become 23. Now, from 4 lakh minus this amount, whatever is the result, so you can mention it here, right? If you minus this one, you get... 3,77,000, I guess, if I'm not wrong. 3,80,000, okay, 3,77,000 can be the amount of net sale. Then, from this one, we have to minus cost of goods sold. And for that one, of course, there's a formula. We have to apply the formula and in order to find out the cost of goods sold. So, what was the formula for CGS? Let me copy the formula. Let me mention it here itself. C... GS is equal to opening inventory. Sometimes also we can call it opening a stock, right? Opening inventory, of course, plus net purchase, of course, plus all direct direct expenses, all direct expenses, and of course, from this one we have to minus. Closing inventory, right? This was the formula that we have to find out CGS. Now we can apply and find out CGS. CGS is equal to opening inventory. How much is opening inventory? Opening inventory is amount of 40,000 plus 
plus of course net purchase how to find that net purchase we have to adjust this one from purchase we have to minus purchase return as well as we have to minus purchase allowance right so somewhere you can find out the net purchase right so from for example from 2 lakh minus 30,000 it became 1 lakh 70,000 from 1 lakh 70 minus 5,000 it become 1 lakh 65,000 right so I'm going to mention the net purchase but somewhere you have to mention uh, this one that how you found the net purchase right so net purchase is equal to purchase minus purchase return as well as purchase allowance 2 lakh minus this one minus this one you get 1 lakh 65,000 plus plus all direct expenses direct expenses are directly given in the question direct expenses equal to amount of 20,000 mention this one and from this one in the formula as you can see minus closing inventory where is closing inventory so this is a closing inventory how much is closing inventory closing inventory is amount of 60,000 press equal sign to get some value how much is the amount 1 lakh 60 1 lakh 65 right so 1 lakh 65,000 how much is CJs mentioned here 1 lakh 65,000 1 lakh 60 65,000 right 65 so in front of the cost of goods sold, mention note one. Mention what? Note one. So in order to uh, make the readers able to understand that how you have calculated the CGS. Kasi ke bol me khaya bo khana ke bo fomak je to CGS paida shat. Ba da inja note one ada inja amnesta ko dar mukhablish baad bo fomak ke ini mi chiz calculate chada dagja da note one. Ba in the point mar kasma de ke marbud ba ini mi sawal mesha iram chiku note one desh amnesta ko. یه نوشته که نوت وان درست هست؟ نوت وان شرا باید کسی که میخوانه باید بفهمه که دمی نوت وان چی گرب شده درست هست؟ نوت وان چی تو کلکولیت شده هر قسمت که در داخل مشکل بود برتان که کلکولیت کنین میتونین در نوت چی کنین برش؟ برش بگیرین درست هست؟ پس یا هم پیدا شد این حالا ایره تف... تفریق میکنیم ازش from, from net sales minus the cost of goods sold whatever is the result just mention here how much is the result? 377,000 minus 165,000. You can do it here itself. 377,000 minus 165,000. Press equal sign, you get some value. 2 lakh 12,000. Check out the schemas. 2 lakh 12,000. 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 لاست شده جا پس میکنیم میره بانامی چیات کردیم بانامی گراف بار چرا گراف بار آفت میگه با خطره که یکی داد مصارف های دیگر تونو دادش کم نکرد درست هست با دزی دیگه چی میکنیم لس آفتنگ اکسپنسز آفتنگ اکسپنسز در کجا منشن شده اینجا آفتنگ اکسپنسز نگفتم اگر انوائی شد گفتم ما میفهمیم که آفتنگ اکسپنسز انکلود ادمنستریتیف اکسپنسز از بل میتونه ای رو بنام انتر کالم یاد میگنه اینجا میتونه قیمت هایی چی کنیم؟ میشن چند است؟ به طور مثال Administrative Expenses قیمت شد سی ازم اینجا میشن که دیگه Selling and Distribution چند است؟ قیمتش برای میتونه که چی کنیم؟ میشن او چند است؟ بیس ست درست است؟ بیس ست این آل توتال شده ای داخل چی کنیم؟ یه نشته که که مجموعیش چند است؟ مجموعی دی چند است؟ مجموعیش هست اینجا داخل برکت میگیره میرم نشته میکنیم برای چند هزار اینجا درست هست؟ یا هم شد پینک قیمت این آلا هست دو لگه دوازده هزار پینجا هزار رو دیگرم ازش کم میکنیم هر چی که نتیجه مون داره دیم اشتم چقدر تفاوتش برش میمونه؟ پینجا هزار رو کم کنیم یعنی میمونه یک لگه شست و دو هزار اگر اشتباه نکنم درست هست؟ یک لگه شست و دو هزار تفاوت میمونه بادم from operating profit of course we have to minus less indirect expenses indirect expenses actually cash limits in the indirect expenses how much indirect expenses it is amount of 40,000 mention this 40,000 right 40,000 then add indirect income how much is indirect income indirect income is amount of 50,000 right mention 50,000 50, this then add this one 
1 lakh 62,000 minus 40,000 and plus 50,000. It becomes 1 lakh 72,000. How much? 1 lakh 72,000. So this 1 lakh 72,000 is called income before income tax. If this is positive, of course, on this one you have to pay tax as well. How much is the amount of tax or the rate of tax? Rate of tax is basically given in the question. 20% tax we have to pay for the government. If 20% tax we should pay for the government, then you have to mention inside the bracket that taxes equal to how many percentage? Taxes equal to 20%. In the bracket, big barish, but tax chan fi sadas, tax masayba, and I'm like that. If you are going to calculate, you can calculate the zarbi chan fi sadas, zarbi bis fi sadas. If you are going to do the zar, multiply to chan fi sadas, multiply to bis fi sadas. If you are going to sign, you can see the zarbi chan fi sadas. سی و چار هزار و چار سال باید تو به دولت چیو کنیم؟ مالیه با کنیم 34,400 is the amount of tax right? So then Of course in this case there won't be any loss در اینجا دوستا loss نگه نیست چرا بخطر که وقتی مالیه پرداختنی شدی با دیگه loss نمه درست هست نتیجه شی هست نتیجه شی بنام net profit از بس loss وجود نداره اگه در فارمات قبلی هم ما loss گرفتیم اینجا loss نه بود درست هست loss باید چی کنیم ما باید remove بکنیم چرا لاس نیست با خاطر که اگر تکس پرداختی دیگه با دیگه اینجا لاس نیست this is the net profit or the net income for the company right then how can you calculate it from 1 lakh 72,000 minus this amount so let us do it 1 lakh 72,000 minus minus how much minus 34,400 press the equal sign you get something نتیجه چند است؟ ارچیده که خیمت شد یک لگه 37 است یک لگه 37 دارو پر یعنی یک لگه 37 دارو پر با نامی شد میکنه اگر بخشیخ بوده باشم سی و چار دار چار ست یک لگه سی و هفته دار شای ست چند است؟ یک لگه سی و هفته دار شای ست سو یک لگه سی و هفته دار و شای ست وان لگه ترتی سوان تاوزن سکس اندرد از بیزکلی در نیت پروفیت سو این دیس وی یو کن پرپر در کندنس و کم ستیدمن فرس آف آل نیت سیلز سیلز دن مینس در دسکاونس دن نیت سیلز دن مینس در سی جیز رایت دن آپریتنگ Then after that, if there is anything, so that can be called as net profit.